Now, is there anything else? Anything else that caught your attention? Oh, uh, under the text, there was a hand-drawn circle. Perfect circle. Also in black. About... this size. Approximately. A circle. Like a signature? Oh, no, I'm almost convinced that it was a symbol. The first element of a logical series. <clears throat> well, excuse my ignorance. I must have been off school the day they taught logical series. Logical series is a group of elements that succeed one another following a particular rule. Could be one, two, three, four, or even numbers two, four, six, eight. Or, of course, it could be the Fibonacci series. <sighs> Fibonacci? A 12th century mathematician. Each element is the sum of the two previous ones. One, one, two, three, five, eight, thirteen. I still don't see the relationship between the murder and these series. I'm sorry. In my book, I sustain the theory that the murder committed for intellectual reasons does not exist in the real world. In general, the patterns followed by a serial killer are crude, monotonous, and uh, repetitive. Cases that can be analysed psychologically, not logically. So you think the murderer is killing to prove something to you? Yes, sadly. I believe that to be the case. Murderer wants to prove me wrong. He wants to show that he's more intelligent than I am and that he can beat me at my own game. Somehow, he knew of my friendship with Mrs. Eagleton and decided to begin there. How about this circle? How do you explain this? Oh, circle's a good way to start a logical series. There's no symbol more indeterminate. It could mean almost anything. So you mean that there's going to be another murder after this one? I'm afraid so. And if we don't discover it in time, could be many more. <laughs>